we from Lahon International School we present to you Social Distancing. Social distancing which has not been fully practiced will lead to worrying concerns for the great risks of infection and transmission of COVID outbreaks as in the case of primary schools in Sabah. For example, on September 17, six students and seven teachers from three schools were confirmed positive for COVID-19. The problem that we want to solve are the challenges teacher faces in keeping active students engaged in classroom. This has become a concern for the teacher as the practice of social distancing could not be satisfactorily implemented. Due to that, we conducted an interview with the teacher concern to find the method or means which can be implemented. Findings from an interview with teacher is one. There are some ideas that we managed to think of, but based on the desire of Teacher Rizwan to solve this problem. And anonymously, we created an innovation called Social Distancing. The idea of this innovation is taken from the thieves trap tools that can detect thieves who violate laser light in addition by using the concept of there is light, then there is sound. As the solution, we created an innovation tool where we want to control students not to reach or disrupt other students' work areas as well as reduce the rate of movement of students here and there, which can disrupt the social work of other students and causes social distancing that can be controlled. We have made plans by making sketches and simulation connections using Tinkercad in producing this innovation. We used an existing table used by students in the RBT workshop and also three chairs as a medium for us to install our innovation tool. We also installed innovative tools that are a combination of non-MCU, buzzer, LED and LDR under each of the three chairs so that they are not visible to students. When a student intrudes on another student's area, the laser light will send a signal to the LED and buzzer, and this will cause the buzzer to produce a sound, and the LED light will go on. Other students will easily know which student is going to be in the workplace of another student, and the teachers can also monitor. Since fitted with not MCU have been integrated in the databases and iCloud, where they can be used using a phone or tablet due to its availability of different GPIO pins. If the student can't sit still and like to walk here and there, the bench will emit a loud buzzer sound in addition to the LED light. In order to avoid the noisy buzzer, students should remain in their respective seat to avoid the chairs being heard and lit. This would ensure that students are always in their respective seating position and movements will be controlled by the teacher. Isn't that interesting? Ah yes, one more thing. If the student wants to go to the toilet, the check will ring. But there's nothing to worry about. The teacher can press the switch button that has been specially designed via phone and tablet to facilitate the teacher. If the student returns to the class, the teacher can restart the switch button to activate the system. Our future consideration is that in the future, we will increase the production of these innovation tools to be installed in every class in Sri Lankan school. And we will also develop a social distancing kit that can also be used by schools throughout the Malaysia to maintain social distancing especially during this pandemic COVID-19, which is increasingly worrying and we are still battling it. We will also build more user-friendly application by using Flatten and Android Studio. We believe that if these innovations are widely implemented, especially in this pandemic era, we will be able to prevent the risk of COVID infections and ease parents' ability to send their children to school without worry. The COVID-19 virus is an invisible enemy. However, we need to be agile to prevent it as prevention is better than cure.